small Texas towns of Gordon and Strawn sit in the hills midway between Fort Worth and Abilene. The people there farm, ranch, and follow their six-man high school football teams every Friday night. Once a year, they play each other. It's not a long trip. Gordon and Strawn are eight miles apart. Kill! Let's go! I think football means pretty much everything to the town. These two towns, they love football. And this, they've always loved football, and they probably always will as long as they're around. Come on, Victor, come on, Victor. Drop, 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 drop. There you go. The rivalry began 86 years ago, and each team has won the game about the same number of times. The Gordon Strawn game is legendary and at times hostile. That's because the towns are so close. It's like neighbor playing neighbor and cousin playing cousin. Well, it's just always been a big deal for as long as I've been at Gordon. That's all anyone ever talks about. These two teams, it's eight miles apart and it's bragging rights for the rest of the year, if not the rest of your life. You can go to the coffee shop on Saturday morning and you're gonna hear stories about the game from the night before. You're gonna hear stories from the game 10 years ago. You're gonna hear stories from the game 40 years ago. And a lot of times you're playing kin folks against kin folks, and uh, it's always been very, very intense. There's stories about some family members that won't even talk to each other a whole year if something happens, and, and, and actually, there's some of them still don't talk now. Um, some kids um, told me when I moved here that, that if, they don't, if they don't win, they get locked out of the house. I think the Strong Gordon game is something you'll remember for the rest of your life, no matter the outcome. It has about the same meaning as graduation. My stepdad is a Methodist preacher here in Gordon. The six-man rivalry, Strawn versus Gordon, he always tries to incorporate that in his sermons. How uh, it's comparable to Cain and Abel and all sorts of things like that. Woo! Gordon lost every starter from last year's team, which gave Strawn its one loss of 2008. Strawn returned most of its state championship team. This year, the Greyhounds are bigger, stronger, and faster than the overmatched Gordon Longhorns, and they're playing at home. Focus and get prepared, and we're, by gosh, we're going to go fight them, okay? Yes, sir, when they sir. play us, they're going to be in for a fight. Understand? Yes, sir. All right, so we're going to take care of our bodies tonight, get some rest. <laughs> Records don't mean nothing in this game. Only what matters is what's right here in your heart, okay? Yes, sir. Right, let's have a good one. I don't care for pick to lose by 100. I mean, I'm ready to get out there and get on the field against Tron. play most of the time you can't hardly get in there. it's standing room only both bleachers are full on both sides of the field cars are stacked up way down from the stadiums just the the tension is uh, is phenomenal uh, during the time that I was superintendent here every year when we hit, played strong I was scared to death I'd start drinking Maalocs about Ready? noon Ready? What you dream about, that's what you live for. I want to be nasty, I want to be bloody, I want to be a fight. Yes, sir. By gosh, if there ever was a time to get it on, if there ever was a time to scrap it tonight, yes, sir. Wouldn't it be now? Yes, sir. One, two, three, four. You know what I want. I want some pounding going on. I want to pound. This is a violent, vicious, vicious game. And that's the way I want to play it. That's the way I want us to be. Angry Red, I want it to be violent and vicious tonight. Game is underway. First and goal from the one yard line of the Longhorns. Completed to number 34, Clayton Klein for the TD. Three minutes, 35 seconds in our first quarter. The score now, the Longhorns eight, the Greyhounds six. First quarter, I score the Greyhounds 22, the Longhorns 8.
Block, block, block. Don't let him. Don't. Pass incomplete from number five, John Jerry. Good job. Red Hunt. Our team is Hunt. Hunt. That's the end of our ball game this evening. Our final score, Greyhound 75, Longhorns 8. The game was over quickly. Six-man football in Texas has a mercy rule, which goes into effect if one team leads the other by 45 points at halftime. The Greyhounds won this year by 67. So Strawn gets to gloat for a year. Both teams have had their moments in the long history of this game. The game goes to Gordon next year. That's when Strawn makes the eight-mile drive to play in one of the richest rivalries in Texas sports. It's never easy to, to get beat like we got beat. Proud of our guys. They never gave up. They never stopped scrapping. We didn't win a game, but we fought. And that, that's success.